say thank you for being back thank you this is the love reading for the Leas for the month of September let's check out and see what's going on for you Leas remember that the monthly readings are up go back and check out the full moon readings download it it's just a dollar ninety nine it is time for you guys to find out what's going on in love Leah's it is a month but you're getting through you're getting over certain issues so let's see what's transpiring for the Leah Sun Moon Horizon sign for the month of September in love we have short-term relationships so a lot of you Leah's are going to be um, getting in these short terms relationship where you meet someone it's nice you're having fun and that sort of a thing it's not going to be lasting but um, you are going to be in that now when short-term relationship comes up it is a time when um, you connect with people from past life just to work out certain issues you leave it behind and you're going to be moving on so these short-term relationships are coming up because you need to heal something between you and another person in um, relationships so when short term relationship comes up especially in a monthly readings um, um, you need to understand that it is just um, for a short period of time that you need to clear up certain obstacles between you and another person okay so don't get this ray um, some of you are going to be finding out that there is some disrail that is coming up in your relationships but it is just um, because you need to heal something okay some of you could be receiving a message from a past love um, and this is an, a love encounter you could be meeting this person for a dinner or something like that um, so it's just lessons learned through and uh, encountering of um, you know via a text message or that sort of a thing uh, sometimes the timing is not right so sometimes you meet someone and the timing is not right the connection is good but it's not long term it's for a short period of time it could be flirting um, having a crush on someone that sort of a thing could be happening and this crush is over by the end of the month okay so let's see what else is coming up for you guys in maturity um, you have mature men you're going to be communicating in your relationship you're going to be saying what it is that you want in your relationship so um, this could be that you're ill in a situation you have gotten divorced but yet still you're communicating with that person it's karma and this is what I was saying before that these short-term relationships that are going to be coming up it's all about karma it's all about helping healing karmas and this is the reason why they're coming up in weakness let's um, check out what is coming up in weakness the weakness is for the young people so some of you are going to be flirting at work you're going to be liking someone but it's not gonna last it's just going to be for the period of the month that you're in okay so um, be aware of this then we have a lot of dating so in reality a lot of you are going to go dating so with these dating that is why short-term relationship is coming up because you're having these short-term relationship um, in the position of dating so you're dating and via the dating because the reality of this whole month is about you dating and this is where the short-term relationship is coming up in passion some of you are going to be connecting with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius person some of you could be connecting with an Aquarius Gemini or Libra person some of you could be meeting someone and this person could have a high-profile job working with government institutes and organization some of you um, are going to be freeing yourself from these short-term relationships so you know like when you flirt or you have a crush on someone I think you're going to be freeing yourself from it because you're going to be realizing that this relationship is not based on um, love it's just based on that you're feeling um, something for someone it could be a crush you could be flirting with someone so this is what the month is coming up but mature people are going to be really communicating um, with people they could be returning to X and you know 
asking for forgiveness or saying you know I really appreciate when we were together however that is coming up uh, you're seeing this coming up in the read and so as we look at short-term relationship it's going to affect more the men 45 years and older where you're reconnecting with people from the past in strong position um, these short-term relationships is karma clearing karma clearing okay so you're going to be karma clearing the weakness the people the young people young entrepreneur you are going to be having some weakness because you're going to be crushing on someone you're going to be flirting with people that sort of a thing in reality a lot of you are going to be da um, dating going out on date and in the passion some of you are going to be having passion with people either in power or people who are Aquarian Gemini's or Librans okay so um, as I said past life reconnection um, the mature men are going to be having these pastime reconnection and you want to reconnect with someone who you were in a relationship with or is a past relationship that you want to reconnect with someone it could be an ex-wife or ex-lover but you want to reconnect so these men 45 years and older you want to reconnect with a past love someone from a past lifetime it, it's not really an ex it's someone from a past lifetime that you're going to be meeting and you want to reconnect with this person now it is not going to be for long term it's going to be short simple is um, reconnecting in um, in passion I'm seeing a reco um, um, code and um, um, co um, code and C is coming up in passion so in the passion in the area of passion for your life I'm seeing this energy of code and uh, codependency coming out in a passion now codependency is when you depend on the other person so you want to be passionate but you depend on the other person to make the move so um, it is also coming up for people who are in relationship just for love and um, just um, for money and you're codependent on another person so you and the passion is not based on true love but it's based on codependency okay in karma what is coming up in karma is that some of you are going to be reconnecting with people from past lifetime and what is going to be transpiring is that it is really going to be a time when you're realizing that there are, are issues that needs to be dealt with there are definitely issues that need to be dealt with and this is what is coming up there's a lot of attractive that is coming up a lot of people are attracted um, to other people a lot of flirting is going on where a lot of people are attracting I'm seeing reconciliation of uh, um, people that were in passion there's a lot of reconciliation that is going on um, you want to um, recall um, and people who were married are going to be getting back together so um, people who are married are going to be getting back together but also people who are married you need to look at the red flags in your marriage okay you need to look at the red flags in your marriage and um, so um, red flags come up in marriages so whatever that is transpired between you and your um, husband or wife in marriage look at the red flags because the red flags are showing up in this month I'm seeing a lot of attraction I'm seeing a lot of people um, especially the young entrepreneur attraction is here you're attracting a romantic partner by enjoying the moments you're spending with this person and this is going to be good because what is transpiring is that you're attracting the right people okay I'm seeing a lot of mature men so, or reconnecting with past love and you're attracting these people back to in your life because you want to have this new relationship that you have had before and you feel as if that this is the person or this is the situation because you have known this person in a past lifetime because you are attracted and attracting people from past lifetime back in your life in the areas of love and this is going to be wonderful and very positive very positive very wonderful some of you who are married wants to be free okay some of you 
um, wants to take back your life. It's as if you're being controlled by your partner and you want to take back your life. Okay. I'm seeing a lot of you getting um, to know each others because you're reconnecting with each others. Um, someone um, out there, you're going to be reconnecting with someone from childhood. And this is someone who you have known um, from childhood that you're going to be reconnecting with. Um, and this person really truly loves you. You could have had a child with this person for some of you, some of you, you could have had a child with this person and um, some of you this is someone from um, childhood that you're reconnecting with and definitely definitely what is transpiring and what is happening is that this person is coming back in your life because it's as if you have to clear some issues and some situation that is going to be transpiring some of you are having issues in your marriage and this these issues that is coming up with your mar in, in, in your marriage is because um, there are a situation um, that is transpiring so let's see what is happening expressing um, love um, some of you need to um, work on your marriage okay um, some of you definitely needs to work on your marriage some of you are expressing your love while you go out and you date these people I'm seeing you're expressing your love. You're looking for that thing that makes you spark. The number seven energy is here. And whenever that number seven energy is coming up with love, it said that they're saying, yes, it's the right thing that you're doing. Communication is going to be the key, especially with married marriage. Communication is going to be key, the key. If you're recon reconciliating because there's a whole lot of reconciliation that is going to be coming up for you layers in love because what is transpiring is that you're you you, you are returning to either past love or people from past lifetime and why is this is because they fulfill you in ways that other people or other relationship doesn't fulfill you and this is the reason why you're returning to these people there is a lot of getting to know another person because people grow you know you can know someone as a child or someone when you were young but they grow people grow and people becomes differently relationships there needs to be um, people needs to work on their relationship I'm seeing people looking out of their marriage for love but um, people need to work on their marriages okay some of you wants to end your marriage but this is not the time they are saying the angels of love are saying you need to work on your marriage so whatever is transpiring you need to work on your marriage whatever the issue is whatever the situation is you need to work on your marriage okay there is a great love that is coming in for you Leos and um, do not walk away from your marriage because you need to um, really work on your marriage expressing love is going to be very important especially to the men for five years and older it's as if you want to express the way you feel about an ex partner who you want to reconnect with I'm seeing a lot of communication and I'm seeing that it's as if you know that this is the love of your life okay a past life relationship is going to be transparent and where people from the past are reconnecting and as if you know that this is the person for you especially for the men 45 years and older for the rest of you um, I'm seeing a lot of attractions um, that is coming up but people who are dating I'm seeing you expressing yourself go ahead and make this romantic gesture because it's going to be working out in your favor um, marriage people you need to look at the red flags that is coming up some of you who are deciding to separate it is better to work on your marriage because you're going to be having some regrets okay so let's move on and see what is coming up for the singles because if some of you decide to go out of your marriage you're going to be regretting that you did this because there is a the mature men coming back a lot of attraction is going to be there between you and other people so you're going to be attracted the romantic love that you need to come in your life so enjoy this moment because it's going to be very very positive okay so let's uh, move on from here and check out for the singles to see what's coming up for the singles all the single ladies and men out there what is happening for the Leo's single 
men and ladies I want to say thanks to each and every person uh, download the on demand it's just a dollar ninety nine destiny is here for some of you okay so some of you singles destiny is here whatever destiny comes up is that something was destined to happen so let's see what's coming out for the singles past life relationship and open relationship I'm seeing people growing spiritually new love is going to be if you are on your spiritual part you're going to be meeting someone who is going to um, heal a lot of past issues and this is going to be good okay so this is wonderful for the um, the single people I'm seeing you reconnecting with people from past life this is going to be good for single people there's a new love there is someone that the universe is sending in for someone who has been praying for a spiritual union whether you're a Christian or a non Christian this energy is definitely coming up for you guys I'm seeing some of you singles deciding to have open relationship and this is going to be working out for you so past life people you're going to be reconnecting um, on vacation um, with someone from a past life um, people who are in open relationships or um, thinking about open relationships the angels are saying that you deserve love okay you don't deserve to be sharing someone or sharing other people in a relationship the angels and the universe is saying that you deserve love do not share and do not go in this open relationship sometimes you were destined there is a deceptiveness in relationships so this is um, some of you singles be aware that there are people um, who are very deceptive so they could be telling you this is what they want but basically they only want sex they are not looking for a relationship so this is coming up for the singles so be aware of this and um, make sure that you're on the right part but um, what I'm seeing is that a new love is coming in and this person was destined to meet you or destined to connect with you so you singles um, the universe could be sending you someone um, that is going to be connecting with you and this is going to be good okay so let's see what's coming out for the couples um, couples in relationship what is coming out for the couples so I'm seeing the young um, um, female ladies you want to have fun time and it's as if some of you are connecting with people of the same sex. Um, I'm seeing you having a lot of fun. You're enjoying. So um, ladies who are connecting with people of the same sex, I'm seeing, um, you know, you're in the, you're in same-sex relationship, but yet still you're having a lot of fun. Uh, some of you could be um, having some control issues with your relationship whatever is transpiring there could be some control um, control issues in your relationship or there could be outside forces that is uh, um, um, entering your relationships so, um, people who are um, in long-term relationship a long-distance relationship I'm seeing you communicating with that person I'm seeing that there is a lot of love between you both um, this is going to be good so whatever is um, transpiring um, it's going to be good same-sex relationship you got to be careful because there is uh, some deceptiveness that is going on okay so um, if you're an older lady in a relationship with a younger person or if you're an older person in a relationship with someone 10 years um, younger than you are there is some deceptiveness in this relationship the control issues um, is here for some of you in relationship there is a, a really control issues and they're saying let go of these control issues okay let go of these control issues so allow situation to unfold okay so if you feel as if there is some 
deceptiveness in your relationship and you're having a lot of control the universe is saying let go of this issue allow the situation uh, to end full because you know whenever people are lying and whenever people try to lie about situations and that sort of a thing you're going to be realizing that the truth will come out at some time some of you who are in long distance relationship the situation that is affecting your long distance relationship is money okay some of you is money it's because you don't have the money to be together with each other or you are working hard so there is a lot of communication text messages telephone calls and that sort of a thing but money seems to be an issue that is affecting your partnership but you know the love is so strong that you guys are going to be overcoming this now some of you are having issues career because you are so busy with your work it's affecting your relationship but this um this is definitely going to be resolved because uh, um what is coming out is that um money is definitely going to be coming in okay money is definitely going to be coming in and because the love is so strong i'm seeing that the universe is basically because it's as if whoever is in a long distance relationship because of the love that is so strong i'm seeing the angels and guides are going to be blessing you with some financial help and with this financial help it's going to be helping you guys to come through this issue people in career um you know at christmas i'm seeing you having the time for your partner especially if you're having um long distance relationship and you have a career which is because of your your work that's why you have to travel and that sort of a thing i'm seeing at christmas you're going to be um like you're going to be making up for the lost time in this month okay so if in this month you have to travel for work um, I'm seeing in Christmas you're going to be making up for this lost time between you and your partner there's a lot of love that is here in relationship and this is what I love with you Leo's is that when you're in a relationship you give your relationship a hundred percent and this is just so wonderful and so powerful don't forget to go check out um, the monthly readings check out the on demand because in the on demand the on demand is going to be given so much so much more um, information that is coming up in the on demand it's going to be um, given a lot of information is going to be coming in especially people that is in the energies of the on demand I'm seeing a lot a lot a lot is coming up for you guys because uh, um, your on demand reading was just so so out of out of the world okay so check out that and remember to like share share these videos this is the energy vibration of love these are all free on demand is that you download your link and that is your personalized um, that is your personal reading the message in that reading was meant for you if you choose for the on demand I love you guys namaste